Hi, I'm Taylor from WeSeller. On this video, I'm going to talk you through how to read a Bordeaux wine label. So what does an appellation mean when you see it on the bottle? An appellation is a geospecific area. It's where the grapes have come from, but it also comes with a particular set of rules. Over time, they've worked out what sort of grapes suit the terroir from that particular region. But there's more specific appellations, what we call town appellations. These we know as places like Pomerol or saint emilion In Bordeaux, we have over 65 different appellations, from regional to sub-regional and town appellations. That can be a bit intimidating. And so when you're choosing a wine, you don't have to remember them all. You just have to remember if you liked a type of wine that came from that region. The classifications in the different appellations differ quite a bit. On the right bank of Bordeaux, in the appellation of Saint-Emilion, the classification is redone every 10 years. However, on the left bank of Bordeaux, in the appellation of the Medoc, that classification was set in stone way back in 1855 and will never change. Let's talk about vintage. When we talk about Bordeaux wine, it's very dependent on the weather. So depending on one year to the next, whether it's hotter or cooler, that's gonna come through in the expression of the flavors in the wines. Bordeaux wine is designed to age. So what's a young wine, what's an old wine? And does it make a difference? Bordeaux wines, you're meant to start drinking after at least three or four years. But that doesn't mean you can't drink them while they're young. They're just gonna be more fresh, more fruit forward, rather than an older wine, which is gonna be smoother. Those tannins are gonna round out a little bit. Let's say you're out to dinner and you're looking at the wine list at the restaurant, but you don't recognize any of the wines. One of the first things you can actually recognize in terms of Bordeaux wines is whether it's a Chateau wine or not. Chateau, when you see it written on the label, means it's the property's first label wine. It's used the older vines. It's more designed for long-term conservation and it has a more complex blend. Most properties will produce a first label wine and a second label wine. You only have the right to put Chateau on the first label wine. For example, there's a property in the Saint-Emilion appellation called Chateau Yonfijac. Their first label wine is called Chateau Yonfijac. The second label wine uses a turn of phrase important to the property, but not that word Chateau. It uses the phrase Le Roche de Yonfijac. This talks about the rocks of Yonfijac, which are important in the terroir, in the second label wine. Finally, let's talk about the back label of the bottle. We can find some pretty important information here. Of course, we'll have the alcohol content, but here in Bordeaux, a lot of properties will have an environmental certification. And that logo will be shown, showing their environmental action and their strategy during their winemaking process. We may even find a note from the winemaker or the owner themselves. Perhaps some notes in terms of the wines drinking and aromas and something to pair it with. Bon appétit.